sure you got enough material on there to work with. And, you know, this is what we did when we did that. Maybe I didn't make enough to make two or three of these. Um, when we did that bar top, we just we just poured the crap on there. And, and then <coughs> you have the, the tool. And you can buy these things with teeth in them already at the hardware store. They use them for putting adhesive on your floor when you're putting down linoleum or carpet squares or whatever. Or, or what? Or you can get a razor blade and cut it yourself. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> or you can get a razor blade. So why don't you just use this, Artie? Because if you took this and you and if you hit the surface too hard, you're going to move everything. You don't want to move everything. You just want to move some of it. So see, as this goes through, you lift off a little bit from the surface. It leaves a pattern of grooves that will flow back together very quickly. And we're just going to roll it right over to the edge. And we're going to have clay on here. And the rest is going to drip off. And then Rob's going to come back and grind off the drips <laughs> with his, <laughs> with his little die grinder or something. I don't know what he's got. but Yeah, and then I just bring it over there. This is nice because it's got a round edge. And the stuff goes over the edge very nicely. And you could do your paint palette this way mm -hmm. and just lay it on there. Let it blow. Let it roll. So is there anything that we have to watch out about putting uh, epoxy on where there's going to be some terrible reaction or anything? Not that I'm aware of, except, you know, again, moisture can be a problem. The Fire! Fire. You don't need much fire and you just need to keep this thing moving very gracefully and aggressively back and forth over the surface. And you can see all those bubbles just going away. I couldn't see any bubbles. You didn't? Andrew. You're not getting a reflection. Come on this side. Yeah, come over here. Come over here you can see them pretty well. You can see them. Yeah, come over here. Why would you use a heat gun? Yeah, I don't know what it is, but... Well, you guys can try this. Come over here. Come over here and grab this thing. Here. 